The recent death of Jeopardy's Alex Trebek has reminded many of the many of us about the importance of paying attention to our health. Trebek died from pancreatic cancer. And local 24 News reporter Brittany Moncrease spoke with a surgeon about the seriousness of the disease. Let's take a look. Awareness is one of the biggest things we have to have done in the world of pancreatic cancer. Those are the words of Baptist Memorial Hospital's Dr. Stephen Berman. So awareness is what Local 24 is providing today. It's one of the most common and aggressive cancers, but it's not often talked about. The most common type is what we call pancreatic adenocarcinoma. About uh, 50 to 60,000 uh, people in the United States are diagnosed with that type of cancer every year. Baptist Memorial Surgeon Dr. Stephen Berman says there's been progress in treating pancreatic cancer, but there's still a long road ahead. I mean, it remains a very lethal disease. Essentially, only 5 to 10 percent of patients that are diagnosed with pancreas cancer will be alive five years later. This year, we lost three trailblazers to the disease. Congressman John Lewis, Supreme Court Justice Ruth Bader Ginsburg and Jeopardy's Alex Trebek. It affects all ethnicities. There's really no ethnic predominance with uh, pancreas cancer. There is some data suggesting that it does occur at an earlier age in the African-American uh, population for reasons that we don't quite understand. The pancreas has two main functions, to make both insulin, which controls our blood sugar, and enzymes that help us digest food. So major symptoms of pancreatic cancer are unexplained weight loss, new onset diabetes in an otherwise healthy individual. At Baptist, doctors have been using immunotherapy, where the body's own immune system attacks the cancer, and improving treatment for lesser known related cancers. In every patient that we've treated thus far, we have uh, destroyed almost all of the cancer at the time that it was removed from surgery. A step closer to saving more lives. We do cure people, and I think that's very important because there is hope on the horizon. In Cordova, Brittany Moncrease, Local 24 News.